Okay, just want to shoot this quick video to share this um, app I'm using for speed reading and this is a really cool hack because it's saving me tons of time um, and I'm actually enjoying reading uh, a lot more than I was using uh, normal books. So uh, for a long time I've been using the Kindle because you know it's great for travelers. Um, you can have all your books on there and just carry it around the world with you. So I uh, still really like the Kindle. I think it's good for a lot of uh, maybe more dense and technical content um, that's maybe harder to speed read. but so far I've been using speed reading uh, now for just like biographies and it's more stories that story like uh, you know narratives that are easier to to follow with speed reading um, and this is this is a game changer for me because uh, I, I struggle a lot with reading normally um, for a few reasons I think I would always lose my place in the page where I was reading and have to go back and reread something um, sometimes my mind would just wander and I'd lose track of what I was reading and again you know have to go back and repeat so Maybe that's just me. I'm not sure if that's ADD tendency, um, but if you have, you know, if you have that challenge like me, then then this is going to be, a, uh, like I said, a game changer. Um, so what I've done is I managed to take all the books off of uh, off of my Kindle. You can download them from your uh, Kindle account to your computer, and then you can convert them to a format that can be used with this app. Uh, the app I'm using is called Readme. Uh, I think it reads books in EPUB format, so you'll need to convert your books to EPUB format, and you can Google how to do that. Uh, but basically, once you have all your books on here, um, you can see that. Um, let me just load it up for you. You can see all my books are here, and once you load it up, uh, what's cool about this app is that you can read it normally, but you can also press this little button up there, that circle button, and what's going to happen is it's going to start displaying the words and you see that it's just the words coming in front of the screen super super fast um, you probably can't read it from there but basically what's happening is that I'll pause it you can see each word has what they call uh, optimal character recognition points so it's a place in the word that your eyes can focus on and that doesn't move so it basically allows you to read without having to change your focus much uh, so there's no stress on the eyes the information just flows across the screen but your eyes automatically uh, recognize the word because they've worked out where to place that word and where to place that character recognition point. So that's just one of the technologies that speed reading apps use. Uh, I really like this one because it's just so easy to use and so easy to read and um, you can get through information so much faster. I mean I read I think I've read almost two books in the last week and that's you know used to take me maybe up to a few weeks to a month to finish a book especially um, long books like Arnold Schwarzenegger's uh, biography is a re really long book but I finish it in, in a week uh, Sam Walton's one I just finished I'm doing a, a review on that soon but you know I finished that in a few days so I've gone from reading books in weeks and months to days and and that's that's massive in terms of the amount of information you can get through um, I find that the comprehension is still pretty good. Um, I'm still able to recall most of you know what I what I read, but I'm just getting through it so much faster, and I'm also able to concentrate because you you can't take your eyes off the screen. If you do, you'll lose your place, and then it's really frustrating. So you basically your attention is super focused, um, and I can read like that for 20, 30 minutes. Uh, I probably could read longer actually, but I just at that point I just have to stop myself and go do something else. Um, so you set your alarm for 20, 30 minutes, sit down uh, with my coffee, with my coffee or green tea in the morning, and just start reading, uh, and it's just made a massive change. So just want to share that hack. Um, definitely go check it out. The this one is the the technology is called Spritz, and the app on the phone is called Readme. So you need to download some software to convert your um, ebooks to EPUB format. Then you can put them upload them to the app through iTunes, and then you just read it like this, and it just shows like that. Uh, when you start out, you can I think that the de the default is 300 words a minute, which is uh, which is what a normal fast reader would read like a book. Uh, but I'm able to up that. I just you know increase 25, 50 every every few chapters, every book, and now I'm up to about 600 words a minute. So it's pretty crazy because you could never read that fast on a normal uh, on a normal book. And I've tried some speed reading courses for like conventional books where you follow your hand down the page and stuff. It, it doesn't really work so good for me. This one is just don't have to think about it. Don't really need to train myself. Your brain just kind of picks up the information and then you can gradually increase the, the speed over time. So so yeah, so I just read Sam Bond's book in about three days uh, and normally that would have taken me easily a couple of weeks to, to get through. So it's a really, really cool app um, helping me to, to learn and grow more and so I definitely recommend it and I think the app only costs like $3 or something so it's super cheap. Uh, you can take all the books you've already paid, you know, paid money on Amazon for and use those as well. So yeah, so check it out. Hope that's uh, useful.